What's up, everybody? Um, I'm back. In case you guys forget my name, I'm Danny Boy Four, and I'm bringing you another commentary. This time, I'm playing Demolition on Jungle. Now, um, in case you guys haven't been paying attention to the PSN blog, um, well, I've been hearing this. Uh, like I said in my last videos, because of the outage in PlayStation Network. Um, they said they were gonna give us um, 30 days of PlayStation Plus, but recently um, I've been hearing some rumors. I think I even saw online that um, PlayStation is gonna give us two games that we get from uh, like the PlayStation Store, and um, I think that's pretty cool. I mean, I wasn't expecting that much, like I said in the last video. But um, there's out of five games that you have to choose from and you get to pick two. And um, I still have no idea what the titles of them are going to be. And that's, that's like still to be like, said. And um, I'm wondering if they're going to like patch it. You know how um, usually, uh, I know I do it sometimes like with the map packs. I just sign on to my friend's account and then I just download it from there. I wonder if they like patch that so like you can't be able to do that. But, um, they said they were going to, like, bring it back by May 31st. But, um, I just checked recently, and they still have no, like, exactly, uh, set, like, timeline for when PlayStation Network's gonna be back. And, um, they said it'd only be, um, about a few days. But, uh, knowing them, they said a few days, about a couple weeks ago. So it could be another week. So, um just hope for the best maybe it would could be um, a few days but um, there's no promises there now um, about these gameplays um, I'm officially like only have like two left so I'm running out and um, I'm trying to stretch it out as much as possible like um, like if I hear uh, another PlayStation Network update I'll upload another video just to keep you guys like um, like just up with the times and like what's going on in PlayStation and um, I, I have another game I might be uploading one every week until it comes back and uh, I, I want to know like what you guys think if I were to maybe just purchase an Xbox I know um, I've seen other great commentators well, one of them white boy uh, 7 Street I know I see him convert um, from PlayStation to an Xbox, but that's that's completely understandable. I mean, he had an Xbox for a, a relatively long time, but he always stuck up for um, the PlayStation Network, and he also relies on it um, because uh, he needs to keep uploading commentaries because that's his job. I mean, if I were getting paid for it too, I'd get an Xbox right away just to do gameplays on that. I mean. I'm, I'm strictly PlayStation, but because I want to get big, um, like in this type of industry, I mean, I, I'm only 16 years old, I know this is kind of a hobby as of right now, but um, I need to be committed to what I do. I need to be uploading like videos like once like a day or every other day. I mean, that's the only way to get successful. I know people like, I've seen like other videos on how to be successful on YouTube and that's one of the ways to do it. But, um, I don't know, it, I, PlayStation, I mean, the system sucks, I know I said it before, like, not the system, like, I mean, just the security of PlayStation sucks, and if I were to get an Xbox, I know I'd be, like, paying for, uh, like, 50 bucks a year, just wrong line, but I know that it'll probably be pretty secure, and, like, it wouldn't get hacked. PlayStation Network, I mean, it's free. Mm, uh, what what else do you expect from it? I mean, like, it, it was destined to happen. I, I hate to say it, but... I mean, those hackers, they just completely fuck shit up. I, I had to give them, like, props for that. Like, to get it down for over a month. I mean, that's pretty ridiculous. I, I mean, they're douchebags and all for doing that. But you have to, you have to look at the other side. I mean, they're 17 years old. Like, I mean, they just hacked down a whole network and fucked over about a couple hundred thousand people. But 
I don't know, you have to look at it from both sides. And in order for me to keep sane through this such a hard time, um, I've been like referring back to like old games that I haven't played in like a couple weeks or months or maybe even years. I know I've been playing like the Fallout series, like uh, New Vegas and Fallout 3. I've been playing a lot of FIFA, I'm, I'm really into that shit. And maybe even like went back to um, the GameCube, like the Nintendo 64. I mean, I've been really bored lately. I like out of my mind. Um, I might, if you guys want to see like different commentaries for that, like I'll just like go back to like Paper Mario, like Mario Kart, and just fuck shit up there. Um, just let me know if you guys want to see that. I mean, it's pretty fun. I like. I remember playing those games as a little child, and I mean, those were just the best. I know I might be um, looking into purchasing another game. I mean, the last one I got Portal 2, you know, I've been doing achievements on that if you haven't seen them. But uh, I might be interested in getting Brink. And um, I've been getting a lot of, I've been looking it up online and I've been getting a lot of mixed reviews. Like I've seen like some people say it was bad and some people say it was like phenomenal. But I do not really know what it's about. I know it's like a shoot 'em up game. But, I mean, I, I need to look into it more. And it, like, it'd probably be another different game. I like different games outside of, like, first-person shooters, like, the Call of Duty series. But, um, if you guys want me to, like, buy that game and, like, upload some, like, achievement guys, just, just let me know. And I've also been looking into, um, the Modern Warfare 3, um, series. I mean, uh, it's coming out this November like pretty much all Call of Duty games have but they have I don't think they have a specific date but um I've been looking into like guns and like all that stuff and I mean most of them are just fake and like Rick rolls which I hate they're just a bunch of letdowns but I've been seeing some videos that like actually make sense I know they have like some old guns some new guns I know they're bringing back um the 50 cal and I love that that sniper but, um, I know everybody else is wishing for, um, like, quick scoping to come back. And, um, I, I'm hoping for it too, because it made, made Modern Warfare 2 fun for me. And I know there's, like, even though they had recently had a patch for, um, like, the snipers so that they could be easier to use, I mean, they still suck. I mean, I hate how, like, as soon as you're aiming down the sights, it like moves instantly, so you can't really quick scope. But I don't know. It's not really interesting. There's no really like good snipers. Um, I know I've been seeing some like things about noob tubes coming back. I know they have uh, rifle grenade attachments, but as you guys probably know in Modern Warfare 2, if you have played it, um, the noob tubes were incredibly overpowered. I mean, it was one of the reasons why I chose really never to go back to that game. Because, I mean, at least they probably won't have one-man army noob tubes. But still, I hope they're just underpowered, like Black Ops. So the game's coming to an end, guys. So I'm 59 and 5. And um, just enjoy the kill cam, and I'll see you all later. Peace.